which is a perfect uh, way to finish off here with our old mates at The View. Conversation kicks in about uh, Kamala Harris and one of the hosts is a massive fan and says you must get behind her but has no idea what she's actually done. I don't know what the hell is wrong with Democrats. Listen, here's the bottom line, guys. Joe Biden's gonna be your nominee. Stop talking about how old he is. And Kamala Harris is gonna be your vice president. So stop fretting, stop wringing your hands and get behind your ticket because on the other side, your alternative is Donald Trump or Ron DeSantis. I think it has a lot to do with this. She's a black woman. Black women get everything done. We've saved this country's democracy for She's obviously for centuries, amazing, but what specifically? But well, like, no, I mean, where should I, I, where, where shall I start? I mean, she was in the Senate, of but course. But no, I mean, as Attorney vice General, president, of course, vice she's president. Highly... She's, she, the Inflation Reduction Act. I mean, the, she what was the face Pence of do? Roe v. Wade. I mean, <laughs> no, the list goes on and on. I'd like to ask you, what, what, did, what, did, what did Pence do? What did Pence do? Except wait. put his lips firmly but on the there, butt but of Donald Trump. Well, no one knows what Kamala Harris has done. You got to remember, this woman was polling at zero in her own party when Joe Joe Biden selected her to be VP and said, hey, in essence, he said, hey, I'm doing this because she's a black woman and that checks those box. I'm an old white guy. You know, the Democrats aren't that bright. We got to show them some pictures here that are going to compute in their brains. So nobody knows what Kamala Harris has done. She was an ineffectual senator when she was in uh, California. I think she was the state attorney general before that. She put an awful lot of people in for smoking weed, in jail for smoking weed, while she admitted to smoking weed herself. Uh, because it's always rules for thee, not for me. Uh, but her list of accomplishments, other than she claims to have celebrated Kwanzaa as a child, which I have no doubt is a lie, uh, is pretty freaking thin. But, hey, there's one privilege, my friend, and it's called Democrat privilege. You can screw up everything, you can accomplish nothing, but you're going to get a pretty sweet gig with a good pension. Just look at Anthony Fauci.